what's going on everybody so today is Tuesday March 20th haven't done a video in a while because we've had three nor'easters in the past like two and a half weeks and we're about to get our fourth um, so I'm just out here doing a quick mod on the Jeep and it's installing um, the Daystar JK hood um, upgrade so it's for the hood latches uh, so I'll show you what those are and uh, basically it's a nice easy mod uh, upgrade modification it's under 25 bucks and uh, it's supposed to help reduce the hood flutter caused by the um, hood latches that Jeep supplies you with so all right let's get started all right so this is the the hood latch that's in here this is the rubber as you can see it's very soft and pliable so we're going to be taking that out and replacing it this one made by Daystar which is a lot uh, harder rubber so it should give it less play and as you can see here it's a little shorter so that way it should also help with the play in the hood and keep the hood fully locked down when going at uh, highway speeds to reduce the flutter. So, all right, so that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna show you quick and easy how to remove these four pins and then it comes with basically this little setup here. It's a screw-in setup and then you can just uh, adjust the tightness. It comes with Loctite already preset on it, so it's pretty good. So we're gonna do this pretty quick because it's starting to hail and it wasn't supposed to start until like 5 a.m. Ugh. All right, so basically what I'm going to do is you got to clamp both sides of these little uh, locked in pins and then kind of twist and pull out. So that's what we're going to do here. That's it. Pop that right off. Just take a screwdriver and you can just push that pin right through and then that pops off. So just keep that, don't lose that. Now we're going to do right here which is attached to the Jeep. All right, so we're going to do right here, which is attached to the Jeep. This one I seem to have a little easier time with on the other side, so I'm just going to pop this on here again. All right. All right, so we just pop that out. Boom. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put this on this piece. This piece, um, it does have a fatter end and a narrower end. Uh, the fatter end goes on the inside of here and the narrow end goes inside here. Alright, so I've got the fat end in here. Slide my pin. See it's in there, now my screw. I brought my screw gun just to help get it going a little bit. Alright, got some movement, so that's good. All right, so with screwing down here, you don't want it to be too tight. You need to give it a little bit of a little bit of play, so it can actually move when you want to open it. All right, so it's all installed. Now we're just gonna put the latch on the hood. There we 
we go. That is that is in there. <laughs> Takes a little bit more effort than using this one, but um, it actually felt like it's really locked in there. All right, let's go to the other one. All right. All right. So as you can see, that's the hood line now, and it used to be able to it used to be able to like shimmy this a little bit with the other ones, but you can't even can't even do anything anymore. So uh, see how it uh, does when we're driving at highway speeds. But yeah, simple, easy mod. All right. So that was very quick and easy. Less than about 10 minutes. Um, less than 25 bucks. Uh, I got it off of Amazon.com, so I'll link down below uh, the link to where exactly I got it from on Amazon. So I think it was less than 25 bucks, and with Amazon Prime shipping, it's here in two days, and uh, just waited for the snow to go away. But as you can see, it's hailing. So our fourth nor'easter in now like three weeks is here. Alright, thanks for watching. If you like the video, subscribe below. Uh, please share the video with anybody you think might like it. And uh, leave some feedback um, in regards to what you think of these uh, hood latches from Daystar. There are some more expensive options out there. Um, I know I looked at some and some were like 80 to 100 bucks to replace the whole hood latch itself. Didn't really want to go that route. Figured put the money towards something else. So. All right, have a great day, and if you're in the Northeast, have fun with this snow and uh, go out and do some donuts. All right, thanks for watching.